most U.S. presidents have had dogs, but the black and tan coonhound holds the distinction for being America's first first dog. They really are a true American breed. In fact, our founding father, George Washington, had black and tan coon hounds with names like Taster, Tipsy, Tippler, and Drunkard. They were popular with early settlers because of their abilities to track down varmints. They're good on a cold scent. So when the animal's gone, long gone before, they'll pick up on the scent which has gone cold. Originally trained to tree raccoons, these dogs have been known to hunt down deer, bear, even mountain lions. This true American dog was bred 300 years ago by combining the Talbot with the Bloodhound and the Black and Tan Foxhound, creating a quick dog with an amazing sense of smell. And the key to his success lies not in the nose, but in the ears. Big, floppy, Pluto-ish ears. When they're running, it flaps around and actually helps push the smell into the dog's nose. As puppies, the ears grow before the legs, and not until they're three months old do they fully grow into them. Along with their ears, the coonhound's ancestry created a beautiful coat that gives this breed its namesake. The Virginia black and tan foxhound is instrumental in the breed, gives its color. But the black and tan's most distinctive characteristic might be those juicy jowls. Plenty of skin around their muzzle with these flapping lips. You cannot look at a black and tan coon hound and not fall in love. Their singing may be music to some ears, but they make for noisy neighbors, so they're not good apartment dogs. He's much better when he's on the trail, when he's got a job to do. Although not hard to groom, shedding is known to be a problem for owners of black and tans. A pretty healthy breed, they can have problems with their eyes, and they're prone to hip and elbow dysplasia. And when it comes to training, you'll need a lot of patience because they're easily distracted by new and exciting scents. And they make a great family pet. So in general, the black and tan coonhound is a noisy dog that prefers the outdoors. It's generally healthy, has few grooming needs. They are agreeable dogs but can be difficult to train. And they're good for active families. Come on, Ray.